Today we're going to have an instructional video on use of the SpecFinder genealogical system and this is part number HD V1 GB1 LRS1. Before we get into the instructional video we're going to go through what you would expect to receive in the contents of your purchase. So the first item we have is the actual spec finder head itself. This is the spec finder head and it has a full computer on board, a screen, as well as the variable zoom optic which provides system magnification of 10x up to 40x. And we have the actual gem base itself, which has illuminated dark field lighting, and it's LED illumination that's dimmable. And we have the 12 volt power supply that actually powers the SpecFinder head and the SpecFinder system. This plugs into the back of the SpecFinder head. And then you have the power cord that comes with the power supply. Also included is a power cord extender and this is when uh, you, you can use this at your option to extend the length of the cord. This is a 24 volt power supply, universal power supply that plugs into the back of the gem base and this provides the power for the LED illumination. Then you have the wireless mouse and attached to the wireless mouse is the wireless receiver and that's a USB receiver that plugs into one of the three USB slots that are provided on the spec finder head. This is the wireless keyboard. We have the LED ring light that attaches to the VZM uh, lens itself and this provides the uh, top-down dimmable LED illumination and included with the ring light is also a diffuser ring. And we have the cables that uh, come with the LED ring light. One of them is the power cable and the other is the software cable. This is the wireless stone holder that comes with your spec finder system and then there is also a post that threads into the gem base itself and then the wire stone holder attaches to the post. This is a light diffuser dome that's placed over the gem base iris and you can use the diffuser dome to uh, block ambient lighting which is critical in the uh, gemstone illumination. Then there's three Allen wrenches that are included with your system. One is a 332nd inch Allen wrench. The other is a 532nd, and then the third is a 732nd Allen wrench. Also included with your system is the actual Windows 7 Professional uh, CD, and the product key label is actually attached to the spec finder head itself, so that's your original disc. And then we also have the Video Toolbox Pro disc and license. Um, and that is uh, installed on your spec finder system. That's the software that actually uh, opens the camera and causes the camera to function. Each of these items are going to be included in your spec finder box. Uh, they'll be packaged in their own individual uh, wrapping or box depending on the component itself uh, and it'll be properly labeled. And finally, when you open your box, you'll see um, a SpecFinder contents checklist 
that will outline each of these items that we've reviewed here today, as well as uh, a, a sign-off sheet. And then there's also a hard copy of the owner's manual, and this will go walk through the detail instructions on how to actually use your spec finder system once you set it up and power it on. And that ends this section of the video.